Well, the super ferry has not sailed yet to the Big Island, but Kona residents today had the chance to sound off about the controversial bill to save the embattled ferry. State senators tonight wrapped up three days of public hearings on the neighbor islands with five hours of testimony in Kona. Our super ferry coverage continues with KITV's Jody Leon. Oh, no, no. Oh. Opponents of the super ferry bill were determined to make their point, and they urged state senators to think of future generations while considering the bill. The harbor master says that our harbor, our home, the place where my students learn, will be taken away because of the super ferry. Others urged senators to beware of the potential spread of invasive species like the cokey frog. <laughs> Four hundred and fifty people gathered at Kailua Kona's Keala Kehe High School, with more than one hundred and fifty people signed up to testify on the bill. There were a few supporters. So, if you have the airline, you have the ferry system, the price has got to come down. But most oppose the bill that would allow the super ferry to sail while environmental studies are done. We are all against this bill. We say a ole no. Super very, super scary. Saving is Aina. That's the bottom line. As you guys are senators, you guys gotta think of the future. Others were not happy with the makeup of the Senate panel. And so I think, I think, no, 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 no. But it's very important when you have somebody on the thing who has already stated publicly, excuse me, Kalani, I am not finished. After three days and hours of public testimony, senators tell us they are far from the general consensus. There is you know, some concern that there's going to be irreparable kind of impact on the neighbor islands. In Kona, Jody Leon, KITV4, Island Television News.